Hey guys, it's Technia K, and today I'm back with another video. In this video, I'm going to install the ZUI ROM on the ZUK Z1. First, as usual, you need to just buy the data, Dalvik Shashi, and all, and just do it via TWRP recovery and swipe to just wipe. Let's just do that, and that's done now. So, let's get back and go to the installation of the ROM. So, just first, I recommend doing a backup of it and if you want me to do a video regarding the backup and restoring of the rom just uh, tell me in the comments down below and uh, after that doing a backup just uh, find your rom and uh, just select it and just swipe to install i'm not just fast forwarding the video because i got a uh, people ask me that how much time does it take to just install the rom so i'm not fast forward forwarding the video for them so that they are not worried about their device it takes a bit of time because it's a bit uh, a bit rom that has a bloatware so i'll explain you about that so let's just wait about it and let's see how uh, does it take and just install the rom let's just wait for some time As you can see the ROM has been installed so I need to tell you that don't install gapps on this because it has a bloatware so don't install gapps just select reboot to system and wait for some time till the uh, ROM just boots up it will take some time I'm not even fast forwarding this part because people ask me how much time it's taking to boot up mine is not booting up so I'll just let it go like this so that you can just take a look how much time does it take to just boot up and yes the you need to if you don't want to download this rom i leave a link to it to my website that is www.techniacool.com do show me your support and just subscribe to my blog daily blogs tech updates regarding it so that it is helpful to you as well i'll just leave a link to this rom that is on my website to in the description down below do, do check it out so let's just wait and let's wait for it to just boot up
and uh, guys i need to thank you for just for helping me cross 100 sub it's not a big deal but thank you it's just helping a lot and i really appreciate it let's just make a target of crossing 200 subs in less than 10 days let's do it you can just subscribe to my channel and i'll just promise you providing good tech updates and good tech videos and now that uh, the rom has been booted up it will ask a few permissions about super su just click grant 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 and just click grant it will just forward you to the rom let's just do it mm -hmm. Skip the part. I'll just skip the part and let's just do that for all. It lasts you to add fingerprint sensor. I'm skipping that part as well. Yeah, it's done. So here's the ZUI ROM. At first, I I really like uh, the look of ZUI, and the thing, the uh, best thing about it is that uh, when you just choose a wallpaper. For a lock screen, it act automatically just uh, makes it in the look like the picture. It just calibrates the color of the lock screen to the home screen. I it kind of, it's kind of new and here is here is the uh, toggle notification toggle and uh, yeah, it looks great. Just like iPhone, but it works great. So let me just check. Uh, the thing is that uh, the capacitive buttons won't work on this ROM as you can see because uh, it is basically from ZUI2 so home home button will work just fine for each and everything don't worry about that here's the camera and uh, right now I am just checking the autofocus you might not be able to see that and uh, the autofocus looks and works really fine and uh, I'll also show you some pictures that I clicked outside let me just check that pictures are kind of snappy and it looks really fast these are the pictures that i click outside and the mind view is that the car was moving and i click the picture while the car was moving so it might be a blurry this is another one that i click and let me show you one more and uh, you might be worried about g apps how do we install that uh, let me just tell you that while you install this rom on the home screen uh, you can also delete the bloatware from uh, your uh, zui rom first i'll uh, just request you to delete all the bloatware the things that you don't need delete all the things and just select uh, the apps and select google play at the top you will get two things google play store and uh, google play uh, google play one more thing download both of them that are just at the top google play services right just download both of them and after that just go to play store login your account and voila you'll be able to download each and every app that you want i'll if you want me to do a detailed review about it just leave a comment below and if you have any suggestion about any videos that you want me to make for you leave a comment below i'll try my best to reply each and every for each and every one to you till then it's definitely exciting you can just enjoy the rest of the video bye bye Ha <laughs> ha